Greetings from Bishop Fenwick. Welcome back to this edition of the vlog, coming to you from one of our social studies classrooms. And I wanted to share with you that last week I spent some time with a few members of the class of 1966. It reminded me of, well, how much things change in schools, while well, things also really stay the same. Of course, it got me thinking about the 1960s. And so I share with you this day in 1960, Ben E. King reported the classic Stand By Me. Two years later, the anniversary of the Black Saturday of the Cuban Missile Crisis, a fascinating time in American history. And in 1964, two years after that, the wedding of Sonny and Cher. Well, none of our students can remember that, of course, and probably very few of our parents. But there's something else that happened on this day in history that's really relevant to what I want to talk about today. So you see a message from our principal, Ms. Marquez, about mid-trimester progress reports. A beautiful quote from Aristotle, and lots of great uh, content about adopting a growth mindset. So on this day in 19, sorry, 1858, this man to my left, Teddy Roosevelt, was born. This day, 1858. And as I think about mid-trimester progress reports and academic growth, I share with you five quotes from this famous president. First, do what you can with what you have where you are. What great advice for students. Do all that you can with all that you have, because you have many gifts and talents, where you are, which is right here at this moment in the first trimester at Bishop Fennell. Two, believe you can, and you're halfway there. Teddy Roosevelt, a great believer in the American spirit. If you can adopt that spirit of hopefulness, of purposefulness, wait, you're halfway there. Believe you can do it, and you'll be successful. Number three, it is hard to fail, but it is worse never to have tried to succeed. Take the risk to set high goals. Take the chance to really set lofty aspirations. That's what we do in other things in life, whether it's the arts or athletics. Do it in school as well. I encourage you to share that hope with your kids. Adopt those high goals and then take the chance, the risk of making them come true. Number four, nobody cares how much you know until they know how much you care. No one cares how much you know until they know how much you care. And who are the first people I think of when I hear that quote? Our faculty, our teachers. While they know a lot, that's absolutely certain. What's more important, they care a lot. They care tremendously about the success and the happiness of each and every one of our students. So reach out to your teachers, seek extra help, Stop by before or after school. Make an appointment to go see them during lunch. They're here for you. And they know that their success is your success. And finally, a really powerful sentiment from Teddy Roosevelt. Far and away the best prize that life has to offer is the chance to work hard at work worth doing. This is work worth doing. All of your classes, all of your assignments, the labs, the papers, the quizzes, the tests, it's all worth doing. It really is. It's hard work and it's worth the effort. So keep doing what you're doing and have a great week. Take care.